I have I have many and we could just say female friends where they're just like I don't want to be up under somebody all the time not all the time but but uh, uh, they, okay let's go to this people always ask because they'll see me in this space and they'll say what do men want mm -hmm. what do women want and my answer is what women want is what Chanel wants okay okay what men want is what Josh wants I might want something different Right. So you have to be willing to understand who that person is and sign up for. It. So everybody doesn't want quality time. Some people don't care about it. Then their and their relationship is operating perfectly. They do one date night a month and their relationship is running. But do you have great. to have the same love language in order no, you to do be not. compatible? No, okay. you just have to. So be I could have the love language because quality time is definitely one of mine. Mm -hmm. I'm extremely busy, but mm -hmm. it is one of mine. Mm -hmm. So would I be compatible with someone whose love language was not quality time? Absolutely. And the reason why is because, again, give me a chance to sign up for what you want. Mm -hmm. I might be physical touch, words of affirmation. Mm -hmm. You That might not be at the top of your list, but because you want to be with me, you're willing to work towards that. You might not be on 10 with it right now, mm -hmm. but you're like, Elam, I'm going to go... I'm going to be a six today. Mm -hmm. By next year, I'll be a seven. I'm going to get to it because you want to be with me, right? Mm -hmm. I might not. I'm not the best quality time person, but that's why even within my schedule, I started blocking off Mondays and Fridays mm -hmm. on purpose. Why? To start the week and end the week mm -hmm. with making sure that I'm more focused around family and who I'm with, right? So I have to be intentional on giving quality time because I get caught up in my work of what I purpose, what I love to do. Right. And it's not that I don't want to be with her. I'm just over here doing what God told me to do. Right. Mm -hmm. So I have to be willing to be intentional, sign up for. Right. Mm -hmm. So no love languages don't have to match. You okay. just have to be willing to do what it takes to be with that person. Okay. Josh, what do you think about the love language? I have a whole different question. <laughs> you know, he's speaking to so many different things. I okay, do agree right. with him from the standpoint of like, people have their love languages but you being willing to work mm -hmm. with with the person mm -hmm. you know i think i think sometimes in relationships people feel like it's black and white and it's not and in every there's a case by case situation and scenario but to his point if you really want that person or if you if you feel there's value in this relationship you're going by any means you're going to do whatever it takes to 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 get that you know what I mean and not only get it but maintain it maintain yes. it yep. and make sure that, that that it flourishes and that it's successful mm -hmm. um, so I, I'm, I'm in agreement with that